Spring is upon us and you may have noticed more insects flying around your yard, especially bees. Bees are of course instrumental in pollinating the majority of our plants and without them we'd actually be in big trouble. Urban beekeeping is becoming more and more popular and it is not as intimidating as you might think. Kevin Fleming explains. Now we're just smoke the bees a little bit, get them nice and calm. Their boys play hockey together and when Brian Fong was looking to expand out of his struggling oil and gas career, he turned to beekeeper Mark Cunningham. I'm trying to see if there's any drone bees in here. Cunningham has raised bees outside the city and in his backyard for 15 years. Queen rearing is what we do. We raise bees. We're not honey producers. And with Brian, we have brought the program into the city uh, to help beekeepers, aspiring beekeepers in an urban environment. Cunningham says the city offers a perfect environment for bees because many of our flowers provide nectar and pollen throughout the summer. If you don't have pollinators, you don't have plants. Natural pollinators now are almost gone. We've uh, kind of destroyed the natural pollinators of, of the world, especially in Canada and the States. Now we have to rely on, on pollinators, domestic pollinators, like honeybees. Cunningham has 100,000 bees in his backyard hives. He's learned over the years how to successfully raise bees year-round. This is the uh, starter kit for the Wax On program. Brian Fong wants to share that knowledge with Calgarians. The two have a number of programs to teach people the craft and make them more comfortable around the bees. You know, there's so many people that have taken courses, have learned about bees, but have not really ventured into be a beekeeper because they feel intimidated. So we, we're here to make you feel more comfortable being around bees. That's our main objective. On top of supporting the bee population, the side benefit of raising bees is harvesting their honey in late summer. Fong and Cunningham say a backyard hive can produce upwards of 32 kilograms. Kevin Fleming, CTV News, Calgary.